to you. See my face is cold. Well, what do you know, guys? It's me again, your lovely girl, Risha. And this is Risha's room. So, I would like to say, I hope you all are having a great and amazing, blessed and prosperous day. Day. Now with that being said, I would like for you to subscribe, share, comment, like, ring that post notification bell so you'll be uploaded. You'll be notified, sorry, every time I upload. So please be patient with me with the videos. I'm going to definitely introduce myself and give you all what you've been waiting for. So, for my new subscribers, um, this video is just basically going to be about my, if you read the title, you already know, Ghetto Christmas Decor. That's right, I said it is ghetto a little bit, but these are the decor items that I didn't throw away. I had them left over from last year so I just unpacked them and got right to it and as you can see here that was the elf this is the fig tree it's cute but I don't know what I was thinking when I purchased this decor I probably was on a budget and just wanted to get something quick and simple to uplift the home and bring in some holiday cheer and you know this is the season to be jolly so i just put all of this stuff together really quickly and try to get as creative as possible i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video stay tuned for a salmon cake tutorial that's right a salmon cake tutorial at the end so keep watching and I'll talk to you guys later as promised your salmon cake tutorial guys here are the seasonings and ingredients that your girl used okay so so far those are the powder seasoning the egg as you can see green onion red onion bell pepper and some garlic 
Yep, I'm just showing you those things right there. All right, basically you have your salmon, of course. And you just add in those ingredients with some flour. I almost forgot about the flour. So now that we have all the ingredients mixed and incorporated together, I went ahead and put them in a bowl instead of having patties. So yeah, I wanted to say comment down below, do you call them salmon croquettes, salmon cakes, or fish cakes? Where I'm from, I think they say fish cakes. But I prefer to say salmon cakes. And I went ahead and made some rice that's not done yet. And peas. And then you have your beautiful, delicious, golden brown salmon cakes with some rice and peas on the side. I would like to thank you all for watching. Please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys next time.